high area. This looks great too. Um, once the battle was finished, yes, the lab would have absolute there, as you note. If you were there, you then you could see exactly. You paid attention to my note, did a great job with that. How great the boldness and how great the spirit existed in the army of Catiline. That's just right. I love the chunking here. You've got your subjunctives highlighted. Looks great. Then, for nearly every man, Namfere quem quisque, who was fought by that place, let's see, had won in battle once he lost his life. It was covered like a course. This is the most difficult sentence here because of the meaning. What he's saying here is a bizarre thought, especially to us. Uh, we who have not been in war and seen people die, hopefully. Uh, it says for just about every guy living, um, the place he had taken by fighting once his life was lost, he covered that place with his body. In other words, they fell where they fought. And there's really almost no way of translating the, this smoothly into English. So it's an almost impossible task, and yet that's what we're here for, right? Okay, three. Catiline and the corpses had been discovered among the enemy by his own men. Yet yeah, Catiline was discovered amongst the enemy, a body, indeed far from his own men. So actually not by his own men, but far from his own. Tricky there, because we're used to seeing this Asuis, oh, that's an ablative of agent. Now, it's actually uh, spatial, it's distance. He even was breathing a little. Yes. And and actually, remember, this ferrochiam que, it cuts it here. So the QUE means the and goes there. He was even breathing, and the fierceness which he had had in life, we was, keeping in his face. He's even breathing a little ferocity and which he had and was keeping in his expression. Yeah, yeah, that freaked you out a little bit, but well done. Yep. All right. At last, no one out of the whole legion was in battle nor in flight. Next, out of the whole uh, uh, army, neither in battle nor in flight, did any Freeborn citizen, yep, was seized. Captus S, there it is, passive, well done. You've got the chunks here, prepositional phrase, prepositional phrase, prepositional phrase, this nice neither nor here, great. You know what's going on, yep. And so, thus, all his enemies had equally spared life. Another bizarre expression in Latin. All, each and every one of them, spared their own life just the same as the enemies. Which is to say that they didn't. They didn't spare their own life, and they didn't spare the enemy's life. In fact, Sallust is saying the opposite of what he means, essentially. So strange. All right. Didn't say it was easy. Nevertheless, the army of the Roman people were not happy. Neque, Tamen, Exercitus, Populi, Romani. Uh, and neither had bloodless victory been gained. So Adeptus Erat, if you check... Ooh, I didn't put the notes. Ah, uh, boy, I didn't, didn't gloss that one. This is a deponent verb, Adepiscor. So it takes a direct object. So the army of the Roman people had not gained either a happy nor a bloodless victory. So that's a tricky one. You gotta know that this is deponent. See, you tried to make it passive there, which is very, you know, your training is excellent. You saw a passive, you translated passive, but it is a deponent. For 
Neither had he most vigorously killed in the battle, nor had he gravely withdrawn. For each person, each and every guy, most strenuously either killed in battle, either had killed in battle, or departed seriously wounded. Mm -hmm. So you pretty much got that bit. That's great. Last piece here. Altem. On the other hand, either they who were surveyed and pillaged had ventured out of the camp in goodwill, those who, for the sake of seeing or pillaging, right, out of the camps, nice, had proceeded. Some of the corpses of the enemy were rolled over by an ally. So this is actually passive, rolling over the enemy corpses. Some found a friend, others a, a, a host or a relative. And repariebon bon is the find verb. Others discovered friends and relatives, exactly. There were some likewise. Similarly, there were those who, nice, those who, that's the qui there. That's always hard to catch. Qui, those who, there were those who would recognize their personal enemy, exactly. Cognoscurrent suos inimicus. So happiness, ita, uh, laetitia, right, happiness, grieving, myro, lamentation, luctus, and joy, gaudia, was widely expressed, agitabantur, through all the army, per omnim exercitum. All right, very nice. Yes, gerundives, one, two. Uh, where's more? I think that's all we have. Can never have enough gerundives. <laughs>